Kal Halal Yahweh, Baha Sham Yahweh Shai, Baha Rukhaha Kodash, double honor to the apostles of the Great Millstone, salutations to the Akim pushing this gospel the world over in sincerity and in truth. Adawan Rakazar, meaning Lord willing, the Lord willing, the second is edified. Yeah, this is going to be a quick update basically on uh, <clears throat> what we've seen going on, you know, with these central bank digital, cur digital currencies, okay, which is leading up to the MOTB. All right, the mark of the beast spoken of within Revelation chapter 13, verse 16 on down. Okay, now this is a recent article from Blockchain News. Okay, okay, December the 5th, 2023, the year that these prophecies are fulfilled. That we hope it's fulfilled. All right, okay, so you know, we're getting closer and closer. Okay, to a, a cashless society, a digital system which the elites, the nobility of Esau Eden, beginning with Amalek. The ish people, small has, all right. They want to control. You know. They want to bring a uh, chaos, order of chaos, all right. Order through chaos, all right. By crashing the system, all right, and implementing new, their new world order agenda, all right. So, uh, it says this article: Brazil's largest private bank launches crypto trading platform in Brazil, the biggest private bank in Brazil. Uh, Itau Unibanco has just made a substantial entry into the Bitcoin industry in a significant step towards the integration of conventional banking with digital assets. The bank introduced the cryptocurrency trading service on December the 4th, 2023. This event marks a significant milestone. This action is a response to the growing demand for cryptocurrencies from organizations and people with high net worth all around the globe. <laughs> okay. And the, you know, the BRICS, which is an acronym for Brazil, Russia, India, China, South Africa. Right, they've already, you know, moved, or at least in the trans, uh, at least in the process or the transition of moving away from the U.S. dollar, which many nations are. Okay, they've already got their, you know, um, own currency underway. Okay, so that, that goes to show you, hey, these nations are, are done with America, man. Okay, All right, and uh, America's on its way out, man. Over 33 trillion in debt. Okay. Huh. This is where we're at, man. Okay. So, you know, if you want to read on, you know, the articles there. Okay. Let's get a couple of scriptures and we can just close out. Alright, just a brief update. Okay. Because more and more nations are, you know, are being introduced or introducing their own central bank digital currencies okay and this is all prophecy bible prophecy all right you're not going to hear this from your plantation christians christianity which you're just a joke anyway you're not going to hear this from the masjid the islamic mosque all right okay you're going to hear it from the servants the prophets of yahweh Hashem Hashem, beginning with the elders and apostles on down who've been saying this for years upon years man okay Jeremiah chapter 28 verse 8 The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old prophesied both against many countries against great kingdoms of war and evil and pestilence and that's what we're coming to man okay and when the prophets on the scene man you know it was a day of you know doom coming okay because prophets all right they prophesy you know the downfall of a kingdom the word prophecy means pro is before and for size to say to say before it happens okay in America, Babylon the Great, all right, is, you know, the final <clears throat> empire, okay, that's going to go down, basically, okay, Babylon, Babal, in the Hebrew, confusion, all right, pestilences are occurring, evil and war, we're in a time of war, man, okay, that's what we, you know, come into. You know, dark times. But ultimately, it leads to the RFID micro C hip. Revelation chapter 13, verse 16. And he, and he Babylon the Great, all right, you saw Edom, so called white race, all right, beginning with Amalek, calls us all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a chiragma in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell unless he has that chiragma or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Like we're going to, to the point of ad nauseum, because really I'm just singing to the choir here, all right. Gonna, we're going over this plenty of times okay you're not going to be able to buy or sell you're not going to be able to function within this society if you don't have that see hip and we're warning our people you so-called negroes latinos native and seminal indians west indians and haitians not to take this advice 
okay? Because you had a true biblical Hebrew Israelite, along with the Israelite foreigners. Speck of bird, all right? You won't travel. You won't be able to buy petrol. You won't be able to conduct transactions. You won't be able to even pay their bills if you don't take receipts, okay? So, okay, we're heading to another... Get into some dark times, alright? So, dark and say, shallow one.